welcome to The Change Guru. This is a place where we get our change on and I've got a question for you. What's the last thing that is going through your mind before you fall asleep every night? I don't know about you, but one of the things that used to go through my head at night was my to-do list. You know, it's my laundry list of everything that I had to do the next day from you know what time I had to start work to what I needed to accomplish to who I needed to talk to to what you know I was going to wear to how I'm going to get there just this never ending list of all the things that I want to do until not too long ago I ran into a practice that the great Wayne Dyer would do every night before he went to bed and it's the concept of manifesting how you want the next day to pan out for yourself now in a weird way, I kind of do this technique, but I call it intention, setting an intention. So before I do something, before I write a book, before I do this video, before I meet with someone, I kind of set an intention of what I intend to bring to what I'm about to do. That way I have to step up and take responsibility for my outcome. But Wayne's concept of kind of setting an intention for how you want your day to unfold kind of took things to a whole new level as far as my whole bedtime routine. His idea was that you could manifest what you wanted in your day and in, alongside his bed, on top of his bed, he has a, a saying that says, you know, good things are going to happen. And to me, the simplicity of that is so profound. So I decided to do a bit of an experiment of thinking about that concept of just thinking, okay, I'm gonna think of all the great things that are going to happen to me, you know, when I wake up for that whole day, all these great things, and always really thinking about good things are going to happen. And I'll tell you something, good things have been happening. And I think it really goes back to that original quote from Wayne Dyer that said, you know, when you change the way you look at things, the things you look at change. Probably there were a lot of really good things that happen all the time, but when you're consciously looking out for them, you're going to see them and you're going to appreciate them versus you know just kind of noticing and letting them be a passing chance. So my challenge to you, and this is a happy, fun challenge, is to, in bed at night, do whatever you have to do, whatever your normal thinking ritual is. And for me, I still do my kind of to-do list in my head, but I get that all out of my head and then I manifest my day. I, it, you know, I just totally intend on what I want to happen, always thinking of good things are going to happen. So my challenge for you is to get all that stuff out of your head and then manifest your day. Try that and see what happens. Really just expect that really great things are going to happen for you. What I found for me is that not only am I noticing the great things in my life on a different level, but I'm actually sleeping better. It actually sends you into a really calm state of mind. Once you get all the kind of your, you've downloaded all of the, the stuff, the busyness of the day, get, get that out of there, to actually think about the good things and how you're gonna have a great day ahead actually is so comforting and it almost is like having a big safety net. And the next day, sure enough, when you're walking around, no matter what you have to do, no matter what challenges come up, and I've had all sorts of different challenges on a lot of levels come up, knowing that there's goodness in the day, that there are great things that are gonna happen, is very, very powerful. So at the very least, I think you might sleep better, but I'd love you to take the challenge of manifesting your day. Now, this is one of the tips that I give on my newsletter. So if you sign up over at thechangeguru.net, you're gonna get these kind of real life little bits of magic that you can use in your day. It's gonna make a big difference to you. So I would love, love, love for you to sign up. All right, thank you so much. And don't forget, tonight, last thing you do before you go to sleep, manifest your day. Have a great week and I'll see you next time. Hey, before you go, I'd love you to check out my new course on Curious.com called Finding Purpose in Life After 40. 
This 11 lesson course is like a deep dive into once and for all helping you find your purpose. That means you're gonna live life with meaning, you're gonna love what you do, you're gonna feel like, no, once and for all, I'm not wasting any time. I'd love to show you more and also if you sign up, you get 20% off the whole course and everything that Curious.com has to offer. You can find the link for that in the description for this vid. So I hope to see you over at Curious.com.